I was trying to install Windows 11 on a local laptop and faced this issue. This seems like a bug as mentioned in various places on the Microsoft's own websites. Normally they recommend to restart the computer in the safe mode or try to delete some files, run antivirus and so on. I tried all of those, but in vain. So I followed these steps on your, which are displayed on your screen and that resolved the issue. So the issue which I faced was that whenever I was trying to log in, it asked me the password was incorrect. And sometimes even the slot to enter the password was not visible. So whenever I was clicking on sign in option, it was just displaying that incorrect password message and then it doesn't provide any recovery options. So what I did, I went to Windows or Microsoft's website again to Windows 11 G page and the link is in on your screen. From there, I downloaded the new ISO file of Windows, which is roughly around 4 GB. And then I made a black USB flash drive by using an open source tool called as Etcher. There are various other tools too, like Rufus, uh, Vendetti and lot, lots of other. You can use either one of them. My favorite is Etcher, so I used Etcher to create a USB flash drive. In order to do that, all you need to do is to go to website of Etcher, download the latest version of Etcher, whatever that is, and then and start Etcher. Then go to Disk Management into your Windows, right click on Primary Disk, and then double left click on the Disk Volume and Populate. This is for MBR used by your own PC. Once that's done, click start on Etcher and then click OK. And make sure that you don't get any extra options in Etcher. Once that's done, it will create the USB drive and your Windows will be uh, reinstalled again with the proper option. And then you won't see this password incorrect bug that will be solved. I hope that was useful. If you have any questions, please put them in the comment section. Thank you.